first at eight tonight, a tragedy in Woodburn. As students made their way to school this morning, a Woodburn High School student was killed while crossing the train tracks by the school. It happened on Front Street near Woodburn High School. Foxwell's Adrian Thomas reports how the school is now handling the tragedy. Woodburn police say at about 8 a.m., a 17-year-old a junior at Woodburn High School was crossing over the Front Street overpass there behind me, which crosses over Mount Hood Avenue. They were walking northbound when they were hit and killed by a train. It's unclear why the student was on the tracks, but members in the community are saying train speeds and overall train presence is a problem. The Woodburn High School community shaken. Viewer photos capture the moments after a student was hit by a Union Pacific freight train Friday morning. Near the portion of the tracks where police say the student was killed, multiple no trespassing signs are there to warn people not to walk on the tracks. Eric Swenson is the town's outgoing mayor and former principal of Woodburn High and also has a son who graduated from there a couple of years ago. He says he's left shocked and saddened for his former school. Tragedy really hits adolescents hard. It hits our high school community hard. Well, as a former high school principal, I know that our staff is right now embracing this family and doing everything they can to be supportive of not only family, but all the students at the high school that are going through this uh, tragedy. A spokesperson for Union Pacific says the incident is still being investigated. According to one city official, trains were permitted in 2020 to increase their speeds through Woodburn from 45 to 60 miles per hour for freight trains and up to 70 miles per hour for passenger trains. All railways are federally regulated. It's, it's difficult. Local jurisdictions don't have control over train speeds, and that's true for all the towns across America. Um, and it just makes train safety uh, that much more important. Local businesses by Woodburn's train tracks also feel the impact of the speed. You can't walk into the building without being met with the loud noises of the trains. Uh, they're whizzing by you, they're, they're loud. And the Woodburn School District Superintendent says resources are being brought into Woodburn High School to support any students who may be impacted by this tragedy. In Woodburn, Adrian Thomas, Fox 12 Oregon.